<laughs> Hi. Ah, yes. Saturdays are made for editing. And Raku it a vlog day. Moin moin gente de YouTube, I'm Furaka Indy, also known as Feel the Indy, also known as Feel the Normal, also known as the Repeater. Okay guys, today is Devlog Day, and technically it's normally Saturday that it's going to be Devlog Day, but who cares? And in Devlog Day, I show new stuff about my game, so let's just jump right in there. By the way, I'm sad that 95 plus percent of you guys are subscribed to me because that means you have no friends to share my videos with. If you have friends, share this video with, with them and tell them to sub and like or else this text will vibe check you. So yeah, let's start now. First up, there's a Discord server to report problems in my game. If you happen to find a bug, I would like you to join the server and contact me there. After pressing enter in the screen, you'll be presented with a small logo intro. It's nothing too major and I and I will change it in the future. And, and I will change it in the future. But at least it's better than just a blank screen with a set timer, am I right? Here's a semi-introductory intro in which Mike, the main character from my game, transforms from his Brigma design into the new design. This version looks kind of a bit creepy, so I'm gonna replace it soon so you don't actually have nightmares about it. And to the very new stuff, the title screen has been slightly changed to match with the new resolution build, and I also added the fact that the game has been worked on since 2018 as Viraku Indie and not Eind, because some of you know, or almost none of you know, that I actually was called Viraku Ind when I start Ind or Eind when I started back in 2017 my channel. Anyways, there's now new options in the main menu screen, like the options. Wow, that's very interesting. And the for now not complete extras. Coming to single player mode, you will notice these images are were now changed. This is because the story has gotten some changes, so these changes were really neat. And it still needs more changes though, as the text still needs as the text still needs to change you and some of the images as well. For something I might change, I've, ad I've added a new jump sound effect. sound effect. I personally don't like it that much, but I thought that you guys may like it. So in the top right corner, there's a info card. You can you can choose right there if you want this effect sound effect or not. In addition to that, there's been some changes to the pause menu. You can now select options. Wow, that's very interesting. Again, unlike before, and while I didn't record it actually, you can watch it for yourself by just testing the build out. That joke, am I right? The one big change on this update is the UI, which is also known as user interface, and it is this thing right here. Like my game, the UI has been changing constantly, but, but I'm gonna talk more about that topic later in this video. You can now see that the time is different, instead of going down, it goes up. Before, you could only be in a level for 250 seconds, or 300, depending on the level. That's now been increased to 10 minutes, so go have fun in that time period. Above the time, there's this new thing called Peddlers. Well, they are not really new, they are like coins in Mario games, or rings, rings in Sonic games, except they don't protect you from attacks. Or, we, or, or Wumpa fruits in the Crash games, your very normal game currency. To the very right, you can see there's many mic faces, if you can actually call them that. The bigger one is my expression and his HP or health points. His face changes, letting you know if you're in danger or not. Surrounding the big face, there are some smaller ones. Those are your lives. Simple. If you run out of them, it's game over. But there's a small twist on the formula in my game. You can only get a maximum of 9 levels. Wow! On top of that, once you collect a life in this game, it will be gone forever. Meaning that if you have 10 lives and click another, one life first, your life counter won't go up, and second, that life box container which the life was is now gone for good. The feature hasn't been implemented yet, implemented yet, but it indeed will be at some point. 
there's all the small stuff in the UI like skills which are stuff like this jump, the air kick from the boomerang, inspired by Paris Lunai, and there's another thing called combo. It's not really important right now so you gotta be tuned in my channel to know more about this feature in a future video. Double feature. And so you can restart at any moment by pressing R when having the game paused. Guess if you are stuck somewhere. It's not like you yet can actually get stuck. While being in the topic of smaller stuff, I tried doing a wall kick, also known as wall jump in, in, America, in America, with the, with the air kick ability. But now it's blocked and it results in a high jump for some reason. I don't know exactly why. There's been windows added to the small house and the corridor has been moved more to the right as I want to finish this level in a very near future. Maybe in the next video, I don't know. Fun fact, I didn't program any sort of level locking correctly, which means you can go to the last level after beating the first one. Nice. But we're not going to do that. Instead, we're going to look at level 2. Level 2. In I plan to change a lot of this level, mainly because it's become so difficult because of the new new engine that's come to the game and because these, these levels are very, are, are very old and are based upon the old physics from my from the prototype from the prototype ages of Freak Man. It's almost impossible to beat these levels. Same can be said about the boss fight, except this one is actually for some reason impossible. I don't know why though. And this is the part in which I I make my promise in which I said that I'm going to show a little kind of like evolution of something. Like for example the UI and menus and stuff like that. I myself, I'm going to say bye to you, but you can still watch the video. Thanks for watching, go subscribe and like, because this text will vibe check you as always, and 